we're celebrating a centennial, a hundred years here in Watts, of the Watts Towers and also of this incredible art center. Whether it's music, whether it's visual arts, you know, Watts isn't just one of the centers in Los Angeles. It is one of the capitals of the world of culture and of creativity. Watts is very rich. Most people come down here looking for 1965. We're not 1965 anymore. We're very rich. There are more artists in all disciplines coming from the Watts area than anywhere else in Los Angeles. We have many celebrations. It's a hundred year anniversary of the Watts Towers. It's the 40th anniversary of the Watts Towers Drum Festival and the 45th anniversary of the Simon Rodia Watts Towers Jazz Festival. It's the people, it's the music, it's the food, it's the just it's just nice and it's relaxing. You can just sit and relax and enjoy yourself. For years I couldn't come because I had to work. So I've been here the last, oh, four times they've had it and I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed the drums. I just enjoyed the drums. It just shows the malleableness of culture, how cultures blend together. The brother that designed these watchtowers was from Italy. He was an immigrant that came here from Italy, and he, he was a recycler before recycle was him. Uncle Sam, my Uncle Sam, Sabato Rodia, he created this magnificent, mysterious, and unusual uh, world monument right here in Watts, the Watts Towers. It's a great day, more investment, more art, more people, and finally, we're back together.